Hello, this week I'm taking a closer look at Centrica after shares staged strong gains on Tuesday. Shares and the owner of British Gas jumped on Tuesday following a report from the Financial Times suggesting it's in talks to secure billions in additional financing from banks amid rising collateral demands. It comes as Prime Minister Liz Truss looks set to unveil new policies as her first course of action in office to tackle the energy crisis, with help expected for both businesses and households with the strain from surging gas prices. There's talk that Truss will offer gas suppliers like Centrica loans so that they can absorb increases in gas prices rather than passing them on to consumers. Gas prices surged this week after Russia ended Europe's access to the critical Nord Stream 1 gas pipeline. Earlier this year, Centrica reinstated its dividend and scored sky-high first-half profits of £1.3 billion. Let's take a quick look now at the chart of Centrica because since the trough in April of 2020 at the height of the Covid-driven market sell-off, shares have been staged impressive gains rallying by more than 160% and have rallied by 55% over the last 12 months. But on a longer-term horizon over five years, the stock is still down by nearly 60%. There's been an impressive ascending trend line with high highs and high lows since August of last year, peaking in July before the stock started to give back some of those gains. We saw the shares briefly break below this key trend line, but are trading above it once again. In terms of key levels, 90 appears to be the next round number resistance, while 93.88, the 52-week high, is also a key level to watch. A break above these milestones might pave the way for further gains. So what do the analysts think? Well, overall, there's an optimistic view on the stock from the analyst community. There are 12 buys, 5 holds and just one sell on the stock, with an average price target of 115.33 which represents a premium of roughly 40% to the current share price. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll be back here at the same time next week with another stock to watch.